Welcome to Discomfort's channel. We're gonna play some awesome games. Oh yeah! And we're back. I'm here with Clifford. Say hi, Clifford. Hey, everybody. And now it's apparently Pokemon 3D. Yeah. Do I, I'm guessing I'm going to new game. Go to new game. Man, I think Professor Oak started dyeing his hair because he looks kind of blonde now. Yeah, it's it's a uh, late midlife crisis. My name is Oak. People call me Pokemon Prof. The world is inhabited. Okay, yeah. So I don't know why I'm si like, is there insta skip option or do I have to click through all this? Uh, probably got to click through it all. So for those of you who have not played Pokemon, I'm I'm not really sure why you're paying any attention to this. But what's your name, Clip? We're gonna skip through all this. Um, what should my name be, Kevin? Give me a good name. Uh. Hmm. Um. Go Ikuro. All right. Right. So your name is Ikuro. Ikiru, are you ready? Your very own Pokemon story is about to unfold. You face some some challenge, way. dreams, adventures, and point being, we let you use animals to fight each other. Oh yeah. Okay, so that's what you meant by first person. That's but that cool. first person, fool. Cool, that's actually very awesome. And cool, we got the Wii. It's the Nintendo. Like Looks like we got the Wii. Good, it's not the Wii U. Otherwise, <laughs> that'd be Talk terrible. Talk about a disaster. Uh, there's your mother. Uh, oh, he can our neighbor Prof Elm. Said he was doing some stuff for it to... So, why did I get introduced to Professor Oak if the professor's Professor Elm? That's just... Isn't that just a little weird? Because Professor Oak is the Pokemon Prof. I'm, I'm pretty sure that he's not the. I'm pretty sure he's a. What's up, fat guy? Yo, we can go. I heard Prof. Elm discovered some new Pokemon. Call your mom on your Poke Gear. Let her know how you're doing. And this is. This is definitely interesting. Pokemon Elm Pokemon Land. Land. Let's see who the fuck is this bitch behind here? Who, who the fuck are you? This is the famous, whatever it said. What you staring? Man, suck around away. Dicks. Oh, there he is. Man, what? I, I mean, yeah. In red, yellow, and blue, Gary was kind of a dick. But your rival in the go in second gen is just—he's just this huge asshole. Correct. Just like I, I think he's actually a criminal, if I remember correctly. Probably. Mr. Pokemon. This time, it's real. He's intriguing. Oh man, you know, I'm gonna... I'm not sure how long we have to play this game, but I do know I need to get a fucking... What, what's the sheep called that evolves into Ampharos? Hey, guess what? I think these are Gen 1 Pokemon. Son of a bitch. <laughs> Unless they updated it or something. At least I think it was Gen 1 the last time I checked. Yep. Gonna get that Charmander? He's that fire Pokemon. Think it over carefully. Your partner is important. Well, I'm gonna assume it's all Gen 1 and they didn't do the mix and match thing. Although I'm sure they're... Yeah, it's not... Not mix and match. Do you want Squirtle? The water Pokemon? No, 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 don't. no, 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 Although, no, everyone get, like, I know most people pick Squirtle because it's like, well, my rival will get the Pokemon that can best it, and so they'll get Bulbasaur, so they'll get the generally weaker Pokemon. But I'm going to be fucking... See, I always picked Charmander because I like so. the challenge. Anyway, I'm going to pick Charmander because I like fire. Also, 
Charizard that yeah. can crips and bloods shoot fire out their mouth? No. L- like you said, freaking Ampharos is just fucking the Charizard of gold and fucking... Oh man, they got Silver. achievements in here now? This is awesome. Yeah, Should I rename or... Whatever you want to do, bro. Freaking, let's rename. I'm gonna make my brain work more. Sure, man. What's a good name for fucking... I will... See Wizzy. I'm going to call you something Char that is related Daddy. to fire. It's almost a direct route to there. You can heal your Pokemon with this machine. Hey, you got another achievement. And this is freaking Natsu's killing. So what's your game plan, Cliff? My game plan? I guess my game plan would be freaking... Oh, I have to choose one of those bitches. Oh, and he rotates. Awesome. Key to go back. Alright, let's go battle. Or do I want to heal my fully he's, healed Pokemon? He's already... He's not... Nothing happened to him yet. I want you to have this for your errand. Got a potion? There's only two of us, so we're always busy. You'd think they would have more people working on this. So I'm in New Bark Town. So yep. this feels like this is... So I'm in the gold universe. I'm in the... Whatever. Yeah, you're in Johto? Jo- Johto, but you have Gen 1 Pokemon, and I guess that's more or less the only difference. But I, again, I haven't played much of this, so there could be all sorts of differences that I don't know about. Dude basically just did, because he had to program this all from scratch, more or less, is my understanding. So he just went with some easier decisions, such as... Limiting the number of Pokemon, even though now there are Gen 2, apparently. Yeah, so he's... Maybe it was a personal choice that he decided, hey, I'm gonna have Gen 1 starters. Let me tell you, the roster of Pokemon could definitely use a little curation. Um, Well, I appreciate the fact that it's 3D and we're doing battle animations... I'm not gonna lie, the battle animations look kind of. I mean, yeah. like, it looks like they're just exploding. It just looks like there's explosions going mm. on behind Charmander. Yeah, it actually sounds pretty good. <laughs> it's like the tomb. Yes. Okay. So, I can't even remember what freaking Pro- Prof Elm was telling me to do. You have to go to the next town and. Some, some. Cause I need to get some, some of those poke balls. You can get a berry from the berry tree. Yo, how are your Pokemon? If they're weak or not ready to battle, keep out of the grass. Hear that, Cliff? Keep out of the grass. Freaking level five, bitch. You don't know cut. Yeah, I don't. Wait, are they not bear? I thought these things had berry. There we go. There's a green apricorn. You want to pick it? You got another cheese. And I can check to see what that does later. It's a little bit disorienting not being able to have the overhead view. Yeah. That's... Um... I'm wondering if that's... I guess that's not a kink, that's actually just part of the way this thing is designed, being 3D. But I wonder if the guy who did this will try to come up with some way to... Yeah, because, I mean, it's a cool concept to have this first-person view, but the world of the game was designed for overhead perspectives. So I have to imagine that there are just situations where you get completely lost because you... It's like a maze. But once again, this game is probably for people who have played Pokemon before, and so... Yeah, it'd be pretty easy to 
to either know the stuff from the old days or there are just maps online I'm sure you could use. Yeah. Because every screen of Pokemon of every generation has been screen capped to death. Yep. What's in that building? That's a good question. Oh, it's the next route. Some mountains. That's cool. Is this, is this the right direction? Um, well, is what's the next city? I don't remember. Friggin... Then, in this case, I might actually just go back and talk to Professor Ohm and actually listen this time. This is gonna take forever. No, not when there are shortcuts, because... Literally, to get back to New Bark Town, I'm, I'm pretty sure I just, I just go through here. Yeah. That's some nostalgic music. Do, 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 do. I'm gonna have to catch one of these things one of these days. Oh, that's freaking awesome. A level 4 Pidgey. Woo anything in the bag. No, no. just as I figured. I wish it had sound effects for this part. Dude needs to get on his case. Oh, son of a bitch. That's, that's terrible. Yeah, you're not doing so good. I'm not gonna use that potion. I'm not using a potion. Use that time-rewinding potion. This dude's gonna, like, kill you so fast? Not if I can get away. That's, that's what we're banking on. Look at the animation on that tail flame. So, she do it really well. I'll have more than enough money to get potions later. Don't yeah. Mind. Now you got no potions left. This dude is gonna bring you down to one HP again. You're not gonna know what to do. I think I can do that. Critical hit. Yeah, I can definitely appreciate what this guy's trying to do. It's just... There are gonna be some kinks and... Things to work out. It Jesus just seems, Christ. Yeah, it just seems much more laborious to get through than a typical Pokemon adventure. And also, there's no... Um, sprinting. And now that everyone freaking uses emulators to play all the Pokemon games, it's like you have an automatic fast forward, and now it's just like slow. Yeah. Don't you get running shoes at some point? That'll probably yeah. Work. Well, actually, I don't think you got. I don't think they developed running shoes until third generation. I thought it was second, but I might be wrong. Either way, then there should be a bike. Yeah, there will, there will be a bike. There's always been bikes. I think this is the one that has the fast bike and the jumpy bike. So, I think he's just saying, hey, go find Pokemon. That makes sense. Do you want to heal? Don't even show the Pokeball anymore. It's... They, they, it's useless resources. Yeah. There are only two of us. Didn't you already talk to her? Yeah, I did, but... You kill me. Let's see if she had anything new to say. No time busy. for this junk. We got busy schedules. So, well, I'm guessing this was just a, hey, let's look at Pokemon 3D. Pretty much, it was there on my desktop, so... So, now what? Are we, are we, are we gonna keep doing more Pokemon 3D, or should we move on to other Yeah, this is, like I said, it's quite laborious. I think, I think everyone gets it, and I think we have driven the point home that, yeah, it's, like, good old Pokemon, but in 3D, but that might not be as awesome as you might think it yeah, is. Yeah, I just wanted to convey the concept more than actually sit here and play 100 hours of Pokemon. Well, well yeah, no one wants to do that. Exactly. It's just, so we'll kill this Pidgey, and then we will move on to bigger and better things, whatever those may be. Oh, Rizzo. Bam. Oh, 
All right, Cliff. My Charmander's level seven. I'm not gonna be able to catch Pokemon soon because they're all gonna die. Yeah, pretty much. You got any last words before we sign out? My, my friggin' Charmander learned Ember, and so now everyone's gonna die. But we are gonna sign out of friggin' Pokemon 3D. Peace. Tune in next up to this conference channel. We might finish building that one thing in Minecraft, but probably not. We might play Oblivion instead of some audio serve or something new. Don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe. Rate, comment, 